Hello ladies and gents, it's Spoonie Pizzas here with the Pro Evolution Soccer 2018 video and today I'm going to talk to you about uh, the Spanish formation that I use in my goalkeeping format, goalkeeping video so um, I know some, some of you might ask the question of um, what it was and what I was using so um, as it, look, as it look, did look promising so here is, I had to make a few adjustments because I found that uh, Sergio Ramos was playing at left back at some time, you know, um, in some instances. Um, so I wasn't sure what was exactly going on there. Um, so yeah, let's let's get on with it. So with that, when out of possession, it's 4-5-1, okay, with uh, David Silva in the attacking midfield role and Busquets in defensive midfield. Now... In my original video, Busquets was a defender, but it would force Sergio Ramos out onto the wing, okay? And I didn't want that happening um, because they were just exploiting the middle. So what I've done is I've moved David Silva into a support striker role to enable Busquets to move into midfield because you can only have so many midfielders. So if I try and... So you can see there, it wouldn't let me have any more midfielders. Okay, so when in possession... You know, you got the two defenders and then almost, um, you know, three there, four, five, six, seven, almost like seven midfielders. <laughs> so it's like two, seven, one. Um, but what this allows is uh, plenty of possession and, uh, and closing down. So let's go straight on to the attack, attacking and defensive instructions. So possession, short pass wide, maintain formation, short support range. Or three for support range, front line pressure, middle aggressive, eight for defensive lines, the nice high high line. Um, I'm gonna keep change the compactness to five. Um sorry, change that back to six. Nope. Should have been four. Should have been four, sorry. Um advanced instructions, tick attacker, and gig and press. Okay. So we'll see how we get on against the uh, their rivals, France, with this uh, this formation and tactic. So I did have to tweak, tweak quite a lot to get this to work. Oh, good save. Cool. And I do prefer Murata over uh, Diego Costa, definitely. Murata's very, very um, elusive. Oh, beautiful. What a play! <laughs> you can see here, it just can't cope with the uh, the short passing. Shifted it beautifully. What a beautifully worked goal that was. So, yeah, the, so the reason I tweaked it was because out here I would have found, um, oh gosh, Giroud near post. I found uh, PK and um, Ramos going too wide, but here is a better setup. Giroud makes a great run here, look at this. Ramos, what are you doing? Trying to do a scissor kick in your own box. Now the only problem I do find with Spain is that they ha they do find it hard to win the ball back in the field, and the reason for that is because they've just got no um, no defensive or tackling qualities really. 
it's all it's all attack. Oh, it's a beautiful run. Oh, I tried the man who shot because it was his weaker foot. Um, but if you watch this, I'm just going to replay replay this back. You watch the. Uh, this is why I like Murata. You watch you watch his run here. Look at his hand. Look, he's pointing where he wants it. Okay. As soon as that happens, what a run that is. You know. Tells him where he wants it, holds his run. And that is why I love Marathi. He make, makes these really, really intelligent runs. His player ID as a striker is perfect for me, personally. Oh, good save. See that Gagan press, you can see very high press and just try to catch the goalkeeper out moving to one side to try and outfox him and put it the other so I'm just going to bring uh, two players towards the ball saw that but luckily my uh, team were able to get back in numbers and he has to out muscled there there's the gig and press kicking in that is risky playing gig and press the whole game because your players will eventually tire Tried to spread it wide, but it wouldn't uh, go wide the first time. Oh, he's spun again. Oh, he's got to score that. Why is he trying with his left foot? Oh, he should be finishing that with his right, but never mind. Wasn't to be. Should have been two one. You don't. You don't always score when you want to. <laughs> That's the game. Would be rather easy, wouldn't it? Oh, he's making another good run. Oh. Again, that. Look, watch his run. But he spins off the back of the defender. In between the two two defenders there. Perhaps should have let it run. To be honest, I might be able to chest it down and. Uh, and finish so a bit of super cancel there get in front of the defender with us Pilaqueta oh <laughs> it's so intricate but it's uh you can do that with Spain because you know their ball control is pretty much second to none. He's off again. Oh, it was a good run, but just caught off, caught offside. But look at look at those intelligent runs he makes. It's fantastic. Should have been that. Once again, that run. Oh. 
haven't got too much to worry about, even if I miss the tackle with um, Drew, because he's not the quickest, so it's not like he's going to run away from any of my players. I'm just going to try and loop this one in, just try and knock it down and pick up the pick up the pieces. But okay, so that was an entertaining first half. Plenty of shots, good bit of dominance. And thoroughly enjoying the formation, really, you know, just trying to get that tick attack without being um, too narrow. You, you do need the width to be able to open teams up, to stretch them, and then you can play it through the middle. A bit like Barcelona do, you know, they use uh, Dani Alves. And uh, Jordi Alba to spread spread the play and keep it keep it wide. So likes of Leo Messi to do what he does through the middle. There's a slightly higher press here from uh, from France. Made it harder to get through there. That front line. Beautifully worked. That was stunning. Absolutely stunning. Oh my word, I love that. Thiago putting for it. Little flick around the corner. Oh, finishes it splendidly. Splendidly, even. <laughs> Look at that little flick. And then just on the bounce. Oh, it just uses the weight of that pass just to curl it into the corner beautiful goal beautiful that was great okay now they brought Lacazette on that's going to be a bit more uh, a bit more interesting for my defenders because uh, obviously he offers a lot of pace in behind so you can't just take it for granted so I'm just going to drop players back um, rather than sort of push them out Nicely worked. Cut back inside. Oh, good play, Tiago. Oh, there's another one. 3 1. Danny Carvajal. Cool. He probably thought I was going to pass it again because I've been passing him to death, but that time I took him on, went past him. And I brought Pyatt on. Mbappe. Actually, this is my this is my new favorite formation for Spain. <laughs> this is this is brilliant. Ah, oh. just look at the options there, though. Just look at the options. Perfect positioning. You know, positionally, it's absolutely perfect. Like they are going to be they are going to be tired by the seventieth minute, but. <laughs> With the Gagan press, so you, you don't have to apply it, but I kind of like it. Um, you know, it's, it's just depends on your preference, really. Never be afraid to go backwards to go forwards. I think a lot of people just think you've just got to run, run forward and pass at the earliest opportunity like over the top through ball you gotta be a bit gotta be a little bit smarter than that
Okay, so France have gone more attacking. I was going to pass it back to the goalie, but Super Cancel to cancel the pass. Oh no, that's terrible. France really have got a second wind here. Good interception there. So even with pacey strikers, um, able to deal with it quite quite comfortably. Nice. Yeah, all my midfielders are pretty much tied now, apart from Coke, <laughs> the guy on the ball there. Oh, beautiful. Edge of the box. Iniesta. That's been a quarter. Iniesta. Back to Iniesta. Can he turn? No. Oh, good defending. Definitely evade some subs. <laughs> that whole midfield is uh is tired and it's dangerous. Any players are tired. Okay, good save. Let's wait for the ball to go out of play, probably won't. Even when they're tired, they you can just I'm gonna let us run. Oh, just trying to trying to find that guy with his run, but that is brilliant, absolutely brilliant. So I hope you enjoyed that video, guys. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you in my next video. Cheers, guys. Bye-bye.